always said, I'm doing this because this is what I love. Now at 10, a father remembers his son, a Pomona officer, killed in the line of duty. Tonight, family, friends, and strangers are paying tribute with a packed vigil. Good evening, everybody. I'm Peter Gow. And I'm Andrea Fujii. A huge crowd turned out near the Pomona Police Station tonight to honor the bravery and sacrifice of Officer Gregory Casillas V. KCAL 9's Crystal Cruz is live in Pomona with more on the remembrance and new video of the suspect. Crystal? Hi, Peter. A large memorial right here outside of the police department. It is several layers deep and continues to grow. And tonight, the officer's father tells us his son was doing a job he absolutely loved. He achieved what he set out to do, but the whole thing is uh, in God we trust and in God he, we keep him. Gregory Casillas IV spoke to his son, a Pomona police officer, also named Gregory the Fifth, daily. And he always said, I'm doing this because this is what I love. And he'd probably do it again. On Friday, Officer Casillas was called to check out a reckless driver seen here on cell phone video. <coughs> video shows the driver crash his truck. Open the door and take off running. Oh. The sheriff's department says the suspect, 39 year old Isaias de Jesus oh. Valencia, barricaded himself in an apartment. <laughs> Shot through a door seen here, hitting Casillas, who died. Chief of Police Michael Olivieri, wearing Casillas' badge number 16, spoke to his community. Losing Greg has ripped a hole in the hearts of his family and members of this department. The Casillas family is feeling the pain right now. At a vigil so large it had to be moved to the street in front of the police department sat Casillas' suffering wife, family, and parents. Because, Lord, I know they'll never, they'll never get over Greg's death, but I know, Lord, through your grace, only through your, your, your strength that they will be able to get through it. Another officer, Alex Wynn, was also shot on Friday, but according to the chief of police, Alex is home recovering, something the Pomona Police Department and Casillas' wife will also try to do. I'm back out here live in front of the Pomona Police Department, an impressive memorial growing tonight. Officer Gregory Casillas V leaves behind two children, including a son, uh, Gregory VI. I'm Crystal Cruz, live in Pomona tonight. I'll send it back to you guys in the studio.